guys, what's up, it's Celtics Dogs here, and today I am back, and first of all, I just want to say sorry about the uh, quality, but, it just, you know, it still looks fine, it's just that it, on the top, you have my desktop bar, and then on the top, you have the other, like, X and stuff, so other than that, it, it'll be okay, just a little bit. So now, in this video, I'm going to teach you how to make, uh, custom item, now not like custom, this here, oh, never mind, I put that in my inventory, but I'll go into this chest, so you see right here it says chest plate, and that's in gold, and notice how it doesn't say diamond chest plate, it just says chest plate in gold, and then it says I'm breaking X, protection X, protection X, protection S, I'm breaking S, and then the chest plate of power, so notice how where it says chest plate, that's in gold, and the, where it says the chest plate of power is in red. So basically, I'm going to show you how to add protection axe three times, you know, or whatever enchantment you want three times over, and then like how to make the lore, which is like the red, ch the chest plate of power, where it says that, and then on the top where it says chest plate in orange. So I will show you how to do that. <coughs> So, first of all, I'm going to do this with a uh, diamond sword. So, I'll grab my diamond sword. And I'll put this in here. Yeah. I don't know why I did that. So, now you're going to have to hop over. For now, I'm going to hop over to MC Edit. But, you need MC Edit, as you probably could tell. But, you also need to download two filters that I'll have down in the description. One's called Modify Item Strings, and then the other one's called, uh, whatever it's called. <sighs> I don't know what it's called. Oh, it's called Enchant. I don't know why I couldn't remember that. Do you think that's the one to remember? So, once you have downloaded those, and put your item in the chest, then hop over to MC Edit, which I will see when MC Edit. Welcome back. Now I am... Now I'm in MC Edit. Totally just forgot how to talk there. And now here's the chest. And if you don't know much about MC Edit, you know, I'm sure you can learn the controls of how to fly and stuff. I'm sure you can learn that. But now if I double click on this chest, you'll see that it has my diamond sword. And then if I just click done. And then now if I click on the tr chest twice slowly, then I'll actually like the chest become highlighted. And also these chests look like stone just you can tell but yeah so now it says my chest contains one item mostly diamond sword I, yeah so now I'm gonna go over to filters which is this little like coffee pot looking thing and then I'm gonna go and find enchant so that's right there so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to find I'm breaking I'm gonna put I'm breaking 10 in there you can do whatever enchantments you want but this is what I like to do. I like to do what I'm breaking. And then whatever to like apply to the thing. And do that however many times I want. But do you know if you go over 10. Instead of putting like a Roman no numeral. Blah, 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 whatever it's called number. It'll put like a enchantment dot level dot whatever the enchantment level is. So just know that. But after you put the enchantments on that you want. You're going to want to go over to Modify Item Strings. And for my first string, since I'm Sultan's Dogs, I'm going to put the Sword of Salt. The Sword of Salt. And I'm going to make that gold. And I'm also going to... Um, I'll underline it, and then I'll make it bold, so it's underlined and bold, and then for the second one, I'm going to make it a dark red for the lore, now if you don't know what lore is, it'll go like under the name and under the enchantments, and it'll say something, so the lore is going to be in italics, and then the lore is going to say, um, salties, Best Wait a second. 
you haven't noticed, I'm not the best typer. Not even close. So now the name's gonna be it, salt, the Sword of Salt, and then it's gonna have like the three or the five enchantments that I put on, and then the lore is gonna be Salty's best sword. Sword, so you'll see that. So then you're gonna wanna I'll, once you hit filter, you're gonna wanna go Control S, so it saves, and then exit out of that, and go back to Minecraft. Now I'm back to my world, and I'm going to go to the chest. This is the chest that we made the enchantments to. If I hover over it, you can see that it says the Sword of Salt, and it's gold, and then it's underlined, and then it has sharpness on there three times, what you can't do normally. And then it says Salty's Best Sword in uh, red. So, yeah, that's how you make, like, your custom items now. You want to see this in action? There, it's pretty powerful, and that's gonna be it for this episode. If you can't tell, it's exactly the second time I've tried recording this, so yeah. But that's gonna be it for this episode. If you enjoyed, I'm gonna put this next week. If you enjoyed, then leave a like. I don't want this round flash. And I keep getting off topic. And I will see ya. Also, the filters will be down in the description down there. See ya.